But here's my Batman the Animated Series collection that I have so far by DC Collectibles. You can see we've got Mad Hatter, Catwoman, Two-Face, Scarecrow, Mad Bat, Mr. Freeze, Bane, um, Creeper, Riddler, Joker, Harley Quinn, Poison Ivy. There's a New Adventures Batman, Batgirl, and uh, Robin, Tim Drake, and Nightwing. We've got Batman right there with the broken feet. Everybody had that problem with him. Uh, we got Penguin. Batman from the animated series is Robin. And uh, I think I already said, did I already say Mad Hatter, Joker, or Mad Hatter, Two Face, and uh, Scarecrow, and Catwoman? Not sure if I did. The only one I'm missing is um, that's out already is that girl, that rocket chick, but I'm not going to pick her up. Don't know too much about the character. Um, and I also have the Batmobile. So let's hope we get a Bat Cycle too, right? For Batman and Robin. How sick would that be? And a Batwing. But this is what I got so far, guys. What do you guys have? We are heading off to, actually I'm gonna get a haircut right now. Seems like whenever I vlog, I, I get a haircut. And um, we are going to hit the Black Friday sales, I guess, even though it's Saturday. Uh, give you guys a little detail on what I did for uh, Black Friday. Because I did do a little bit of shopping, but I didn't record anything. Look at that view. Sick. Uh, so we went to Black, or yeah, we went to Black Friday on it was actually black thursday to be honest with you and i hit best buy and i hit fries for that friday and or that thursday and it wasn't you know there wasn't really a lot of sales that i can say i needed to jump on um i picked the only thing i picked up was a blu-ray player because i needed one and it was a Sony one. The original was like 120 and they got it for 40 at Best Buy. And I picked up some Blu-rays. I picked up the, the Blu-ray, the horror movie. You guys seen uh, Stephen King's Christine, which is finally on Blu-ray or it's re-released on Blu-ray because I think it was released on Blu-ray, but it like went up in price, whatever. Uh, I picked up also Inside Out for 10 bucks and Sandlot. I think I, I, didn't, I didn't know I didn't have Sandlot for Blu-ray and I picked it up for uh, $4. And then um, I, we got the movie Hotel Transylvania and that was free because we, if you buy a, a movie from that certain section, it was buy one, get one free. And I think the, the movie that I got from that section was, I think it was Christine or it was Inside Out. It was one or the other, but you get one and you buy the other one. And you get, you get one and you get the other one free. But uh, that was it. I didn't see much Blu-ray. I didn't see much Blu-ray. What movie? Movie. What movie? The, the Minions. We didn't get a Minions movie. So we didn't, there wasn't really a lot of Blu-rays like to choose from that I didn't, that I really wanted. Not even on the box sets or the TV seasons, but um, that was that was about it. And then uh, I had, I didn't go to any toy stores. I went to clothing stores though. I went to um, Macy's, I went to Van Store. This is on Friday, this is actually Black Friday, so the next day. And I went to, um, so I went to GameStop, but I didn't pick anything up. There was nothing great or nothing you know worth like I said there's nothing worth picking up but right now we're it's Saturday I think some sales sales are still going on and we're gonna hit a few toy stores just to see what's up oh take it back I went to corner store comics and I picked up the um, flame effect from uh, Bandai by the Tamachi nations I picked up the flame effect and um, I picked up the Dark Knight 3 comic book one of the variants I think there's like a hundred variants or something but that's all I picked up uh, there was nothing else really I got so and I got my son some clothes at the mall but right now we're heading to the gas station to get some coffee and then get a haircut and then I'll see if I can record anything at any toy stores. I'm out of the barber and I am now going to be heading into Toys R Us. I have no idea how the uh, like the traffic or anything is going to be in here. It looks like there is a lot of cars and the thing about this place is that there's a lot of stuff around here like there's a Costco, there's a Chuck E. Cheese and like a bunch of little like clothing stores and there's an in and out which is always like packed here so we'll see how good the um the parking is I, I don't think it should be too bad it probably shouldn't be too bad all right so here we are again this isn't black friday guys so this is like the day the day after black friday but it does look like there's a lot of activity going on here more than usual no seems pretty normal Seems pretty normal. Yeah, there's Toys R Us right there, and parking is not found anywhere close to here, so we will have to hunt for parking. That. Stop moving it. Let me see who is it. Show the camera. Egyptoid. 
Got the retros back out. Dad. Yeah. Check the back out. Ooh. These little guys. Try me. Oh. All of them back here. Next to him, Jason, you can see how tall he is. <laughs> Come on, Jay, go stand next to these. Whoa! <laughs> Come on. Throw <laughs> the magic clip. Only you can touch it. Headphones. Go back. There it is. Green cord. Nothing. There's a little bit of things on sale from the Star Wars, but nothing too crazy. No black series, nothing. Just stuff back there. Got some cool backpacks, though. I want this, even though it wouldn't fit my face. To collect amiibos, these are on sale too. You see, Friday 7 a.m. and Saturday only. I don't know anything about amiibos, but they are on sale in the NECA aisle. But I can't find it, they moved everything around. I don't know where um, all the NECA, the NECA stuff, the NECA stuff is. for this little toy hunt edition. Uh, I don't know if I'll film anything else on this. If I do, then you guys will see it. But there was nothing really in there. And you know what was weird? See, I'm in the I'm in the Anna or Fullerton um, Toys R Us, and there was no, I could not find the NECA section. There was no NECA anything. I think the only NECA items that I saw were the little scalers, but this Toys R Us didn't have anything NECA. I don't know if they're trying to push them out or if they just moved them, but I couldn't find them. Um, there was no real sales like some of the Star Wars stuff had sales but it looks like this is just the stuff that's not selling and um, but it looked like a regular day like a regular normal day that's like not Black Friday or some special event um, because there was nothing really stocked and there were still the same old Marvel Legends that you see and uh, same goes with everything else but I mean the blade blasters were there which is really cool there was a lot of them a lot of the a lot of legacy uh, stuff was still in stock but um yeah, that's pretty much it. So if I do end this video here, how did your Black Friday go? What did you guys pick up? And where did you guys go? Let me know in the comments below, guys. So see you soon for some reviews.